This is Talk of Asian Marketing with a special emphasis on localized Chinese consumer behavior. Yeah, Have the you biggest. seen this big before? Uh, no, it's the first time I, I'm, I'm here. But I, I, I know it's the biggest in the Thai country. I think it's the biggest one. I heard yeah. there's another big one. They're hard to judge what's bigger or not bigger since yeah. everybody escapes their taxes anyway. I'm not uh, sure how you count the revenue. <laughs> but uh, anyway, here we are, and we are just in one little piece of it where we got some space. Later, we're going to go in and see you know, the actual floods of people here. James, uh, what do you think? Have you seen this many people at a Carrefour? Yeah. Well, yeah, not 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 at this time in, of, of day, basically. Where everyone's milling around and there's a whole lot of energy and excitement. It's in fact, fun. it's interesting. I was just looking over here because we're always talking about Carrefour and the samples. Anthony, can you swing the camera over and get this lady over here giving away samples? Keep going over there. She's giving away samples. Why don't we go try one? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah okay, let's try a sample. Okay. How about that? Are oh, you guys already tried it? one here. Okay, it's enough. Take. Oh, see, 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 see. A little shrimp, right? Yeah, yeah, a little ah. shrimp, tiny mm. shrimp. Mm. Crispy. Crispy? Yeah. And sweet. Yeah, sweet and lively. Yeah. 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 yeah, crispy and sweet. And very red, very red. Ah. You see the boss? He's a lao ban, ma. He's a lao ban in the ear, ma. Ah, he's a lao ban. He's just like bang bang. Okay, so we're going to go into the street market here and take a look around and see what we can see. General things we should pay attention to. Look out for all the fresh shopping that's going on. Of course, since we go to Carrefour, you just don't see this amount of fresh moving around at all. You'll see all the bread, meat, the fish, the vegetables that people are really buying. So a lot of that we should really be looking out for. And uh, I know some of the interactions might be interesting as well to, to see that. But uh, we were talking about that earlier, wasn't we? The bargaining that goes mm -hmm. on as well. Yeah, because in uh and uh, uh, carry for mark. Yeah. Uh, they, their bargaining skill yeah. is uh, set up by the company. Yeah. It's all the same, all the same. It's uh, just a uh, limited. Yeah, limit. But uh, here, uh, the <coughs> the seller will, will will use the different kind of uh, uh, skills or the techniques yeah. to uh, to make uh, to sell their products. Yeah. It depends on the different uh, situation. And you can see a lot of the people selling things here are very anxious to talk to us. And this guy here wants to keep calling yeah. over here. Uh -huh. Very friendly. And so a lot of salespeople pull you in, and then that bargaining is part of that relationship. It, it is. And it's part right? of the excitement to watch people. The excitement. Coming. Yeah. 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 Really, really a lot of excitement. So these guys, everybody will rent their stand usually, right, Stephen? These stands will all be rented spaces, right? Yes. In a place like this, this looks like an apartment building, so probably there's some kind of joint renting going on here, yes. right? But out on the street, every stand will be rented, and there'll be an owner running it. Usually they'll get their family to help them out, or they'll hire some people to help them out. What do you think the margin on a lot of this stuff is, Stephen? The margin? Yeah. Um, if we're talking about a Carrefour, yes. maybe you're in the 10% range of a margin. If you're lucky, if you're lucky you're that'd be pretty high. Yeah. What do you think a margin is out here? Uh, it's a higher. Higher, higher. Okay. Yeah. But it depends. It depends. It depends the supply and the demand of the product. I think one key okay. point is a lot of the, the supply channel. You know, you come in here and you think it's a little bit chaotic, but actually this has a very established supply channel yes. where it goes from the farm, from the ocean. We can see some fish here from the from the pig farm, and they really channel it right in here. It's very efficient. Yes. 
Yeah. I think Jane talked to us about that. She did, yes, yes. It's something perhaps we should look at as well. I know you've done the work on the chickens and you've gone right out to the slaughterhouse. And yeah, we've been there. Whole, you know, the whole chain there, but it's something we should look at. I think it's kind it of wasn't, you know, we were just driving over here to pick you guys up today at the train station, and me and Anthony, we drove right by a pig farm. And so you're really not very far outside the city before you get a lot of this agriculture, and they can just channel it right in very, very efficient. In fact, of course, you sometimes see, don't you, the farmers who just drive their truck right in, they yeah. stop on a roadside, they drop the back, and they're selling more Well, we'll see that. We can see that out here when we walk around. Sometimes you'll even get some people come into the wet market, and they just push a cart. Yeah. And that way they don't have to pay any rent, and they just make their sale on, on the... Uh, on, on yeah, the wheel on there. Way, yeah. Yeah. And it's kind of interesting how sympathetic people are towards oh, people totally. doing this because there's that real feeling between each other that people are just trying to make a living, I think. And so there's a lot of sympathy about people who push their card in, people don't muscle them out. They're fairly easy going. Well, they're all these family the businesses. Yeah, they're all family businesses. You won't find anyone here who's working for a bigger company. Although they may buy from larger companies or they may be involved in other channels, but everything here is family run. So it's great to come in and make your friends and make a connection. So what do you say we uh, walk in, set up inside, take a few shots and just let people see how busy it really is? Yeah, sure. Let's do that. Okay. Here we are, you can see the street goes all the way down this way. We just came off another perpendicular street that goes all the way up four or five blocks up that way. Yeah. Really I a mean, big market. It's well, it's like about two, three blocks, isn't it? Yeah. Long, yeah. Yeah. You can drive your car all the way around here, really big. Over here we have some really fresh fruit. So we separate the apples. We have the American apple. Uh, these are the Japanese apples. Japanese, yeah, these are the American yeah. apples. And these it's are from local, Taiwan local, local, here. Yeah, local, okay. local. And our oranges. Oh, yeah. Those look really sweet, you know. You like them, huh? <laughs> and you can see the way the, uh, yeah, the yeah. flesh is just crinkled. That's yeah. real sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, yeah. This is what we're buying, huh? So we get a free sample here, a nice yeah. sample. Very good. That's super sweet. That's fine. Okay, okay. You like those, huh? Those are really sweet. You think that's good? Yeah. Hey. Oh, very good. Okay, James, Stephen, here we are. We get to see another part of the wet market here, and that is other stuff, not just food, right? So over here we have lots of flowers, really nice flowers. These are very fresh flowers. These are just starting to come out over here. Very beautiful. Yeah, this this kind of flowers are for the new uh, new year. Uh, yeah, everyone will uh, buy this kind of uh, uh, <coughs> stuff uh, and put in the uh, uh, inside the family. Uh, the, 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 I mean the house. Yeah. Inside the house. Yeah, the inside the house uh, for the deco uh, decoration. Uh, and it's uh, right for the uh, new year. This one must come out and be a nice uh, kind of red color by the looks of things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they got the red flowers. This there. is always a flower stand though. Even if it's not New Year's, they're selling flowers yes. on this corner. This, this corner's always got flowers. Yes. So when you come to the wet market, it's not just some fresh food you can get, but all these other things too. And by the way, why don't we come over here and look at this surprise that we can get, which are clothes and specifically underwear. Well, you saw And here we have uh, an underwear store. Anthony, maybe you can scan over here a little bit and get our underwear store. 
here, of course, we have our red underwear, which is for good fortune for the new yes. year. Right, Stephen? Yes. And um, Stephen, you want to tell us about the price yeah. sign here? Yeah, the price is very low, you know? Yeah, yeah 10 bucks for, <laughs> for each. It's a pretty low price. Yeah, very that's low price. Good. And the use... 10 NT. Uh, so that's about what? About uh, 40, 35 cents US, yeah, right? right? There's right, not right. even a dollar, a third uh -huh, of a dollar. Uh -huh. And what about that sale price there, Stephen? And they they also use the uh, the television home shopping channel uh, as the, the Dongsan Dong 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 Yeah. So they say their price is lower, lower than the TV shopping price. Right. And the TV shopping, when you watch that, they say their price is lower than the department store. Uh, yeah. So yeah, here we have the reference, yeah. right? Department yeah. store. And then we come down the TV, uh, TV shopping, shopping and, and then we come down the street market. Yeah, uh, and so it's beautiful in a way, right? Because you can come here and do your shopping uh, and you watch TV to get the advertising yeah, for it. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right? Um, and it, I think it's really nice how you're saying that it's a reference price. I think that's... Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's, get the yeah, sign yeah, up yeah, here, Anthony. Dong, Dong Sang Go right here. Yeah. Beautiful. Price, beautiful. Yeah, so this yeah. is... This is, I okay. love the way this works, you know, so you get that yeah. advertising, you see it, then you come to the wet market. And it's just, it's, yeah. it's all points of uh, comparison, isn't it? Just come by I wonder yeah. how much it actually does go for, I mean, 10 cents, I mean. Oh, no, on, on, in a department store, it's a lot. Oh, it is, sure. Oh, yeah, 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 right. I mean, you say that's a point. Star price, isn't it? Yeah, right. exactly. So, uh, what else we got over here? Just regular underwear down the street. This is more flowers down yeah. here. And I guess we can go into the market some more and find some more interesting stuff. Well, that's it. We're in fact, because we're just looking down here. I think it's really nice. We're walking past it. You can see down there, there's the flowers. There's the chicken's feet. Would you get some chicken oh, feet? chicken feet. That's a great snack. How do you like eating those? I'm not big on it, but my kids love it. Yeah, Steven, no, you like right. chicken feet? <laughs> yeah, uh, kind of. Sort of. <laughs> I just like those fried ones. They're sort of okay, but it's also bony, you know? Right. And then right next door to that, so we keep going along, I think it's interesting because you have the chicken's feet, and you've got some other, I can't remember what those were, meat dishes, that's a vegetable. It's all mixed up. It's all mixed up, yeah. There's not a whole there. lot of breaking it up in the category, but here, this is always, this place here is always flowers and underwear. <laughs> So there's some category. It's, I think some stores like to get together, mm -hmm. but in general, it's all chaotic and mixed up. Okay, here we are, the same street market, the same wet market, only now we're inside, there's an inside part. And I think if you visited Hong Kong, this would look more familiar. In Hong Kong, there's a lot of wet markets yeah, like this. Exactly, yeah. mm. You've been to those in Hong Kong? Yeah, just as you were saying that, I was thinking, yes, the click, because in fact, you can almost see it's like a set of houses that have just been covered over, exactly. just in between, basically. Yeah. So you Alleyways, them. they've covered up the alleyways, and, and we can see that they've set it up. And you can get really small stands like this set up. Some are bigger shops that are inside the buildings. And so if we get a shot down here, it's a real good angle. You can see the whole walkway down here. Oh wow, look at that ginger. Yeah, it? yeah. And there's really some beautiful stuff here for cooking. Yes. These are uh, different kinds of uh, beans here. So we have all these kinds of beans. Some and this would be for well. sugar. So cooking up soups and things like that. Yes. Right, come in here and get this. And it goes all the way down here. You can see a lot of meat sellers inside. Yeah, in the bean, bean oil. Bean oil, yeah, oil stuff. For cooking. And these shops are set up here every day, every yes. single day. Yeah. I don't think there's a, there's never a day off, except one day a year. Uh, New <laughs> Year's is the day yeah. off. Yeah, that's the and what, what I really like about these places, if you look right across, you can see there's clothes shops and other kinds of shops. And it's almost got that department store feeling, only it's a lot more. Yes. A lot more than that. Watch out. And we have traffic, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> lots, lots of traffic. Everybody's very friendly. You go in and talk to the shop. I've been here many times. You know what I really like is you can ask people how to prepare a food, yeah, how to prepare yeah. a meal. Yeah. And, uh, maybe the the customer will uh, do doing the social uh, 
social activity here to make the tea, here. yeah, hanging out here yeah. for the yeah. uh, making the tea. Yeah. Yeah, tea, drinking some yeah, tea, drinking some tea. Uh, sitting around, just like the one talking. we saw as we were coming here. Yeah, Do you remember that couple that we saw in the street just on the way, mm -hmm. um, just down here? They just stepped right out, they're having a little conversation with the stallholder, chatting away. Exactly, you don't, you don't necessarily have to buy anything. Yeah. You build up a relationship and then later you do buy something. This is Talk of Asian Marketing with a special emphasis on localized Chinese consumer behavior. Thank you.